This is our app with the GBU logo. Here we have a splash screen transition before the starting of the app. Starting of the app is very eye catching with the banners, font style, logos. Now I will log in into the app with my school roll number and the date of birth as a password. We even have a Google, Twitter, Facebook page link attached within the app. When we log in into the page, we find a slide bar sliding leftwards of the screen. We have a transportation page where we can find a right provider in the campus. If you click the call icon, you can see there is a number in the dial pad and you can call. As we all know, GBU is so big, someone can definitely get lost in that place. So don't get worried, just go to the map page of the GBU app, select the destination and it will show you direction to your destination. In the GBU app, we also have library. Just click on the library button and you'll find the list of the books available in the library. It consists of multiple columns so you can find your book easily. The very basic need of every student, timetable. It is also attached in the app. As we click on the timetable age, our phone automatically opens up the timetable in the landscape mode. By selecting the school option, we can find our timetable on the screen. As we go back to the page, there is a help desk option. And here we can find all the helpline contacts of the GBU and some FAQs. Back again, there is an admission icon where you can find fees. Admission brochure, program, seats, eligibility, and test criteria. Again, on the home screen, we have a notice icon. You don't want to miss any notice. Then, here we have a solution. You can find all the notice in the app. Here we have a calendar page where we can find the list of holidays. GBU also consists of a bank. Punjab National Bank for emergency, you can find the details of the bank in our app. Next we have a setting page. Here we have options of dark mode, focus mode and even details of the app developers. Here down we have a logout button. If we click that button, we will come out of the GBU app and then we have to log in the page again. Next I can see is the school page. That will provide you with the list of schools in the GBU. Then we have a sports page. All the sports played in the GBUs are mentioned here and the details of every sports will be mentioned in pages. There is even a club page. If you are part of a club, then you should definitely use this app. All the update of the club will be provided in the phone. The notification will keep you updated. If you go on the top of the page, we can see a profile page over there. I'm going to the profile page. My details are here saved already with my name, about, phone number, roll number, school and branch. Right now I'm not going to do any changes. I'm simply going to back to the home page. At the center we have a page like at GBU. If you click this page, you will find all the memories of GBU with the photographs, videos, cute moments, all are uploaded here. It also consists of three videos. If you scroll back down, you will find these videos. Last at the corner but not the least. Here we have a feedback page for the students to give the opinions of our app so we can update and make it use it freely for every student. I'm gonna click on a happy icon and then on the suggestion button I'm gonna write everything is fine here and then on a send button. All the feedbacks will go to the developer team.